Hello and welcome to a little special edition. So these are the models for the ColecoVision and Intellivision and now we're going to my new, yeah, should I say, model set or a cartridge set. These are the Super Nintendo, these are the Ataris, NES, where will be the N64 so it's a little bit um, stored in this way due to the fact I'm filming the N64 collection and this is my MSX collection so maybe this will be a next version and the NES is coming next after I finished the N64 where will be a little Sega special I don't have so many things about Sega but uh, maybe this is interesting for you so the next one will be the NES after these but now uh, in this little video I think it's really 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 short I have some additions you ask for it this is the famous zero wing um, just to know I get it there will be more in the Sega video I got a new Intellivision game Sub Hunt this is should I say an awful game this is really a bad game um, but now I have it Cosmic Adventure is okay it's a nice should I say shooter something um, it's okay I think a lot of the ColecoVision games are very good so if you get a chance to get these cartridges well mostly okay the next thing Defender yes I got Defender for the Atari 2600 it is is an instant classic this is maybe one of the origins of any uh, space shooter this is really good I got it with a instruction manual maybe ah, show it sometime so and the last thing after a lot of searching I got it back I owned Moby Ranger as a kid for the MSX now I have it back it's um, should I say it's a mixture of a puzzle game or um, you control this creature and have to save some kids to um, push rocks and uh, to float about something uh, it's unique I think it's worth a let's show I don't think it's worth a let's let's play I don't think so uh, but maybe I will show it in detail the Super Nintendo I got some Pitfall Mine Adventure is a nice jump and run it's not my favorite Pitfall it's okay if you can get it um, if you can get it very cheap it's okay but it's not that special humans I know it from a PC and I never thought it was uh, released for the Super Nintendo but this is a famous puzzle game um, it's okay this version is also okay if you can get it it's okay it's not that great but hey you can get it for one euro so get it one thing was missing from my collection Animaniacs um, I think Animaniacs were much better than the Tiny Toons themselves um, this game is a mixture of a puzzle and jump and run and um, this is really good this is really interesting it remembers me, remembers me a lot of Ship and Dale here there's Ship and Dale well, where does it get it? Ah, where's Chip and Dale? So it remembers me a lot. Uh, it has a very corny humor like the, the series. So if you can get it, this is really interesting. Big Sky Top Trooper something. Never heard of this game and as first played it, I know I never heard of it. It's a Lucas Arts game, but why don't get it true lies once again a film license game and um, yes it's also that good 
So, if you're a big Arnie fan, maybe you can get it, but if you aren't, no. Major title! Yes, do you need another golf game? Um, yes, um, you don't sick of Tiger Woods and his uh, tons of add-ons. This is a golf game. It's an okay golf game, but it's golf. What should I say more? It's, it's golf. That's all. And the last new edition is Izzy's Quest for the Olympic Rings. Um, it's interesting. It's maybe unique, but um, it's one of these US gold games where you think, what I'm thinking, well, why did that? Um, so it, it's okay, uh, it's maybe uh, worth a look, but I don't uh, recommend it. So um, if you're interested in these, maybe just look into it. So this was the little add-on to my cartridges. So. Um, the next weeks, the next few weeks, I think, will be the N64, then there will be Sega, then there will be NES, and when you ask for it, you see my Adventure Collection, and you will get it. Believe me. So, have a nice time, see you in the next video.